Hello, boys and girls, welcome back to Beltless Factorium, where we are still waiting for our first train with screen science. But we are on the way, we have um, 2.8 thousand loaded here, and once we hit 4,000 it will move to the second station which then should have the order 4,000 uh, available to load. So we do have uh, a bit of uh, supply here so that should be good for another almost 600 uh, bottles and then probably the same amount here so that's 1200 that makes up the the 4000 um here uh, we still are lacking a bit but in the last few episodes we have been uh, trying to get more out of this space and uh, aside from uh, furnaces uh, running out of coal um, we do see uh, issues like this one where the train seems to sink they can reach this station even if the station is occupied and at this point I'm not entirely sure if this is an issue with my setup or with the game itself you remember we have basically the same problem here for the uh, uh, smelting arrays that's why we basically uh, put down these waiting bays and that at least keeps most of uh, our our lines free from clogging up but I had to tweak things a bit so that this train does not move on to this signal because usually that would be a normal signal not a chain signal because uh, if the trains are not loaded because there are not enough uh, gears in the chests we need another iron train and the iron train needs to come in here so that's why I added uh, this square here in the back but if we would have train sitting in front of this signal blocking this junction this train could never enter the station and deliver the iron and we would basically be uh, deadlocked so however our current measure of uh, uh, goodness of production are uh, the electronic circuits the green circuits and as you can see uh, they are fluctuating a bit and we definitely want to get more and for green circuits we need copper wires and we need iron plates and we if we look at what we're producing um, for, uh, for uh, 60 and what we're uh, consuming that's way less and same with the iron plates currently it's almost equal uh, but I think we can actually add another uh, electronic circuit factory so then the question is where shall we put it we have one up here and 
up here we probably want to have a waiting bay so we could we could do it down here and this setup is not optimal uh, we could actually copy this setup here which has double the amount of uh, factories uh, already has uh, two inputs uh, everything hooked up we only need to uh, change the the recipes so let's copy that Ah, um, we also need the square there. So probably we want to copy the whole lot. And there. All right, we have a few cliffs. Um, and some other things to get out of the way and then we can start building this thing up so i will do that and then we will see if we actually do have enough resources or if we maybe need another iron smelter oh and there was an issue this station and this station they were separate so all the trains only wanted to go here and this station was empty so now that that is fixed we get a bit more uh, copper uh, iron ore through here and that's probably also the reason why basically all the chests here are full everything is in and as yes, you can see down here we already had our first delivery but now with more uh, potential production we probably also should uh, make sure that we have the proper delivery service as well so bit of coal in here and then we take this train Copy it and then we have pick up plate fueling yeah go that way and maybe we also need a train for more copper wires uh, copper wires are here mm. oh um actually this one sitting here copper pickup copper loading copper plate delivery yeah um no, 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 that was the wrong one.
This one. Uh, I want to copy that to this and to this. Then we'll send that to here. And that eventually should get us a bit more green circuits. And if we look at this train, 500 more. And we will move on to the next stage. And probably just with the content that we have here in the chest, we can manage that. Uh, I'm actually not sure because the amount we have in here when the train moves over should be the same as uh, what we have in the train but actually it looks more like uh, it's only half that amount so something went wrong uh, somewhere along the way and here we still have a bit of an uh, imbalance uh, way more copper wire here I mean down here we are actually full um, what's up with that train why does it not move on while not loading at the same time? That's a bit concerning. So... Oh. We should have it like this. Because insert a stop at 500 circuits loading, uh, and if we have a strict uh, larger, then well, we will never finish the loading. Uh, here, same problem, and here. And here. Okay, that might be part of uh, why we are not getting enough uh, throughput there. But with this, we should soon see more um, green circuit production with more green circuit production uh, we then should also see uh, more uh, inserter production and then maybe we also need more belt production or just another train there uh, so we get more regular deliveries here but currently, by the looks of it, uh, the problem here is not really the delivery, because we have these chests sitting full, but these machines, they just take their time crafting. And with only one train uh, for the for the green uh, science packs um, it may take a while until it is fully filled up so I guess we can let this run a bit see if there are any other issues that we need to tackle and hopefully by the end of this episode we can actually see this train moving 
to our research square up here. Um, we then have to move out this train somehow because the green science train wants to go into this slot. But one problem at a time. While running around here filling up the furnaces with coal, I oh, totally overlooked that our uh, green science train is now actually full and is looping between a uh, loading and train fueling because the uh, the actual uh, delivery station is missing on the on the schedule um, so we'll fix that empty cargo wants to go here can probably not reach because the red science train is in the way yeah um, then this one this station is labeled wrong because clearly I am dead so you should not try to rename stations while standing on tracks luckily but this was not too far away and it's not the first death so let's grab the remains of my body scrap it off the rails there uh, maybe also rails with them then we will fix this one right this is red science delivery and we will send this one on its way and uh, once it leaves this one can then enter the station and we can continue with our research which we will then push or i will push uh, before next episode to uh, to the blue science chemical science pack so that I can then handcraft uh, a few of those uh, 250 so we can get the electric furnace and then I think uh, we will continue with uh, what we have remaining here mainly landfill and here we see the train coming in and research starting up again because uh, up here we often see that uh, trains um, stack up here on the on the rails because we have so many places that uh, want to have gears uh, so maybe here another waiting bay but that's it for today hope you enjoyed it and join me next time for more beltless factorio until then goodbye